welcome to another video brought to you by the good people at FM Wonder Kids. Today we've got a list of bargain Wonder Kids in Football Manager 2020. Um, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe if you're new. Um, these videos will be coming out thick and fast now that the game is out. Um, so let's get straight into it. Bargain Wonder Kids Football Manager 2020. Um, if you can see here, we've done extensive scouting um, and the year is now 2028 in Football Manager. So these are all, all the players that we've been looking at, we've been scouting, we've been researching. We'll let you know how much they cost at the start of the game so you know exactly how much you're going to need to pay for these players and we let you know how good they are in essentially nine years' time how good they get. Um, so again, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe. Um, it really helps the channel grow let's get into it so if we go to our short lists here you can see we've set up a first 11 of wonder kids these are bargain people they're going to cost you less than 20 million okay less than 20 million each go we'll start straight away with the goalkeeper danny martin spanish got some good stats one-on-one is the one that stands out kicking reflexes concentration determination yeah and he's got a bit of um athleticism as well the media description is that he's experienced goalkeeper. It's very hard to find world-class goalkeepers, I'm going to be very honest with you, in 2028 in Football Manager. Um, but this guy is playing for Real Madrid, so that's the kind of um, calibre we're looking at. Here's the ability and potential ability as well. Okay, um, Okay. so next we're going to go for right-backs. This guy here, Gonzalo Montiel. Oh, by the way, Danny Martin, we're getting for 9.5 million at the start of the game. Um, Gonzalo Martielli. This guy here, if you look at his stats, he's quite a defensive right back. Um, at the start of the game, you'll get him for around 7 million. Um, I think he's playing in the Argentinian leagues in River. Um, but look at his mental mental side of, this, of the game there. Aggression, anticipation, bravery, um, positioning, work rate. So defensively, very, very good player. <clears throat> and um, physically very good as well. So... Next left back, attacking fullback. This guy is his name is Vasquez. He's absolute peanuts at the start of the game. Um, I think you'll pick him up from Valencia. He's playing in the B team. Uh, not setting the world alight here statistically wise, but you'll fit, pick, pick him up for half a million pounds. Tackling the determination, acceleration, and pace there. So good. Moving on then to the centre backs. A um, bit better quality here. You can see. Elite centre back and a powerful centre back. We're going for Javier Montero to start with. So you can see that's really good, solid stats from him. He starts off at Atletico Madrid. Uh, he's actually out on loan, which is a bit of a pain because you won't be able to get him straight away. Um, but you can pick him up for, I think, around 18 million. You can see he's got the marking, heading, passing, positioning, determination, concentration. It's all there. And his natural fitness is 20, so very strong, kind of like a, a John Terry looking uh, kind of character there. Fantastic. Okay, so if, if you need someone straight away, though, and, he, and yeah, you need a centre-back straight away, maybe don't go for this guy because he's going to be out on loan for a season. Maybe go for um, the guy at Celtic, the Danish guy, AJ. Uh, I think it'll cost you a little bit more money, um, but it'll still be under 20 million. He's still a really good prospect. So yeah, check him out, AJ from um, Celtic. Next guy, Jerome Onguini. Okay, powerful centre-back from Cameroon. He's playing for Tottenham here at the moment. Um, but if you just have a look at his stats, you can see the physical side there. It's really dominating. Let's click on that now, open that up. Dominating the physical side and the mental side of the game there. Um, technically, he's more of a no-nonsense centre-back, I would say, but definitely very good. Um, mentally at the start of the game uh, you pick him up for 14 million 14 million pounds so again all these players are under 20 million at the start of the game pick him up get him in your team and look what he develops into okay uh, next time we'll go to center midfield um, we've got this guy Henrique um, as the kind of our defensive kind of playmaker in this team yeah um, he's lucky he plays for Juventus at the moment uh, you pick him up for 16 million at the start of the game I think he's playing in Brazil you see he's got the technique and he's got the vision, first touch. He's got the mental mental side of things and the agility as well. Um, 
so that's our centre midfielder. Defensive centre midfielder, I should say. Here's our attacking midfielder. We're going to play this gentleman here, Reina. Now we're getting into the good stuff. Right, dribbling, first touch, long shots. Natural fitness, 20. Determination, flair, composure, all above 16, yeah. This guy is an absolute beast. If you look at his positions here, um, we're playing in centre mid. Uh, he's more of an attacking mid, really. But um, really, really good if you look at those potential and current abilities there. Okay, then moving on to the right and the left wing. We've got Dembele and Pellegri. Pellegri, okay. Dembele comes from Celtic at the start of the game. Um, you'll pick him up for, I think it was 18 million. Let me just check my notes. No, 10 million actually at the start of the game, Dembele. You pick him up for around 10 million. Look at that, crossing and dribbling and first touch and pace, agility, really good on the wings there. Determination as well, yeah, and you can finish as well, crucially. So good inside forward. Um, if you play him, if you look at his preferred foot here, left footed and he prefers to play on the right. So yeah, exactly that. Um, for that reason, we're playing Pellegri on the left as an inside forward. Um, just going backwards here, Reina, I didn't give you the, the price that you'd be paying for him. It's about 17.5 million you'll pick him up for at the start. So don't forget that, 17.5 million. Uh, Pellegri then, one of our best shouts on the game. As far as affordable Wonder Kids go, you're getting 15 million at the start of the game. Remember this guy's name. Look at his physical attributes, unparalleled, yeah. Dribble and finish in first touch, off the ball. Ideally, you want to be playing him in the striker role, but we're playing him on the wing as an inside forward um, just to balance out our team. In behind those two then, Thiago Alma Almada, Almeida. Yeah, you pick him up at the start of the game for a nice £6 million, yeah. One of the best Wonder Kid shouts in FM20, this guy. Look at that mental ability, yeah. Technical composure, agility. Yeah, very, very good. You can also play in a lot of positions in the attacking um, part of the pitch. Um, and you can see he's developing here. Okay, last one then. We're playing this guy up front, but he, he can also play on the wings here. Uh, but just to give the balance to our team, we're playing him out wide. Um, purely because Pellegri, um, why is it again? It's because of positional sense, I think. Positionally, oh, it's because they're preferred foot. So we got a left footer, a right footer, and a left footer. So we wanted to, we didn't want the two left footers obviously on the wing. We wanted one left and one right. Um, so then Gerhard then goes into the centre. But you see, he's got the the ability to play that role. Yeah, dribbling, finishing, first touch. Off the ball, composure, acceleration, and pace. Yeah, the only thing really lacking is head in, but like I say, Pellegri has got that ability where you can maybe switch him in. Um, place for Wigan at the start of the game, you're getting for £10 million. Yeah, so definitely someone worth getting. Get him in your team, give him a couple of games, and um, in nine years' time, he'll develop into a £52 million striker. So you can see the media description here. We've got experienced goalkeepers, world class midfielders here for you, elite attacking midfielders. And elite strikers like the video subscribe the video more wonder kids videos coming soon head on over to patreon if you want to support the channel you can download all the short lists that we're using that we've created and that we've scouted for you guys um links in the video description have a great day and i'll see you next time on the next video